This girl deserved so much better. In 1945, a two-year-old girl named Sadako Sasaki was eating breakfast with her family when a nuclear bomb was dropped on their city of Hiroshima. Although she was lucky and survived relatively uninjured, when Sadako was just 10, she was suddenly diagnosed with leukemia, which had been caused by radiation exposure. But despite being given just one year left to live, she never lost her kind and optimistic spirit. When her parents gave her money, she bought them gifts. And when she heard about a legend that says a person who folds a thousand origami cranes will have a wish granted, she began folding as many as she could, hoping to one day be healthy again. But despite completing way more than a thousand, Sadako passed away at age 12. Today, however, she and her cranes are international symbols of peace, fighting for a world without nuclear weapons. With the recent threats of nuclear warfare from Putin, it's critical right now to talk about the consequences of these weapons and about how a world without them is possible. It'd be amazing if you guys could show your support for the cause by folding your own cranes on social media under the hashtag cranes for our future.